Well, you guys, if you've got Windows 10 and you're suffering with uh, hanging, freezing, slowdowns, um, not responding when you're browsing and stuff like that, then this could be due to your SSD, uh, which is hanging basically and freezing. And, and what I found was with a bit of research is by using this, it resolved that issue altogether. Now I suffered this problem for quite some time because I just put up with it and uh, I wonder whether it was a Windows 10 issue and it turned out to be something to do uh, with the AHCI link power management and uh, basically you can add this in and it sorts the problem out. And it was sort of, I got it mainly pinpointed down to the SSD and I was basically uh, scanning the SSD uh, and the SSD come up fine. There was no problems with it. Also, when I was typing uh, text out, whether it be in a comment in YouTube or on Discord or something like that, what was happening was I was getting a massive freeze up and all of a sudden the words will come up on the screen. And then also you could end up with freezing, which would be a delay of five seconds, right up to 20 to 30 seconds. And then all of a sudden it will come back again. And this was happening quite a lot. And I thought it was a hardware issue, but it turned out to be just this actual power setting here, which you can actually fix by adding this uh, this in here by Sean Brink. And uh, I found it on the Windows 10 forum. So I thought I wanted to share that with you and uh, just in case you're having those issues like I was having. Now, what might happen to you is what happened to me is when you're browsing, it sort of looks like it's a browser issue and you'll get not responding up here and it hangs and all of a sudden the page goes white and it comes back again. And also typing stuff out text wise and stuff, you get hanging and freezing. And I thought it might be a motherboard issue or RAM issue. I tested all that and it turned out to be something as simple as this. Now, obviously I'm hoping that if you're having this issue yourself, where you're ever, whether you're having hanging issues, freezing, slowdowns or anything like that, um, not responding in the browser or stuff like that, then try this method and see if it works for you. So basically on this site here, you've got a couple of options available here. And what I'm going to do is use the registry uh, edit here. So I'm going to download this. This will then come down and I'm going to run this on the system. And uh, what you need to do once you've done this, I'll leave the link for this in the video description. And uh, this is quite a useful uh, fix. So let me just close this off. I'm going to reboot the system. OK, so I've rebooted the system and now I'm going to go into the power settings here by typing power and go to power and sleep settings inside here. You can now go to power and sleep and on the right hand side, additional power settings. Once you get inside here, make sure you're on high performance and you should be OK here. Then make sure you're going to change the plan settings here. Click on this one and then change advanced power settings. I could already see that these folders and these boxes are opening up a lot quicker. And inside here, we've got the AHCI link power management. And you can see I've got this set to active. You can change this to other ones down here depending I've seen some people say the lowest is better for them depending on what it is that works for you try this out I'm leaving this on active right now and I've got no problems uh, with this at the moment now this was causing me massive problems and when you do a bit of research and look online for uh, freezing SSD you'll see a lot of problems coming up and it's all related to this and they sort of uh, relate to um, di text disappearing while you're typing and then freezing when you're opening up the browser you're getting sort of that not loading or not responding and stuff like that so when you do a little research you can see here it's not just affecting uh, Samsung drives it's crucial drives and it's a bunch of other drives that it's affecting and it's uh, if you read some of these articles on here there's some really useful information so what you want to do here is you want to come down here. There is another fix that you can run this uh, to fix the issue. LPM needs to be disabled and uh, it can be disabled with the registry tweaks here, as you can see. So we're going to just copy all of this information here as well. And it's telling you to open up Notepad. And it's pretty straightforward stuff. Open this up and we can put this inside here. And we can save this as 
let's see we'll save this as fix SSD dot reg and then make this all files and save this to your desktop so I've got this inside here now you can see if I look inside here we've got the files done so I'm just going to double click on this and put these in here and hopefully that will be the end of that issue once you've done that you can reboot the uh, system okay so I've rebooted the system I just want to show you this last bit here just make sure you're checking the firmware make sure the firmware is fully updated and also uh, make sure that the drive is in good health and working okay because sometimes uh, the drive may be failing and you don't want that okay so make sure everything is running okay and you've got a good green light for uh, these fixes and hopefully uh, you should be up and running and should be having no more issues with this now this problem shouldn't exist in 2019 but honestly if you've got this problem where you're having massive issues like this then this fix will resolve it and uh, hopefully you'll have happy computing from then on because this was driving me nuts for a few weeks and I thought to myself the hardware is dying I need to be build, build myself a new PC and now uh, the system is running as fast as ever and I'm getting no problems whatsoever so just a bit of research and someone taking the time to put up a fix like that is helpful even to people like me because uh, obviously you can't know everything in this industry and it's nice sometimes to find someone like that putting up a decent uh, bit of content that helps other people anyway I'm starting to waffle so I'm going to end this video my name is Ben Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk I will leave all the links in the video description I shall see you again for another video real soon. Have a great weekend. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.